Hi, this is JC with Beyond 20. And today, what I want to take a look at is in the strategic portfolio management uh, module, previously IT business management, um, they have updated the project workspace. So in the release notes, it's actually uh, classifying it as a full, fully new application. Um, as you, if you've worked with an ITBM before, the project workspace has existed, um, but this is just kind of a, a complete overhaul. So what we've got on the screen right now is the new project workspace. Um, you can see it does look very similar to the old one. It's got these cards with all of the projects. We can see these are green. Uh, obviously, this is just demo data. Um, we can see the start and the end date. We can see who the project manager is. So really just kind of a, a good, quick, and easy way to see what's going on with it. Uh, but this isn't that unlike the old project workspace. Um, However, if I go ahead and click on one of these, uh, we can see that it does bring me directly into the planning console. Uh, so what we see here is it's just, honestly, it looks quite a bit cleaner than the, the classic planning console. And you'll notice up here that you still have the ability to go back to that um, if you don't like the new interface. Um, if we go ahead and right click in here, we do have quite a few options here. We can I mean, edit the cell, copy the cell, um, add a task above, add a task below, add a tile task, add a dependency, all of these different items, which I think is super helpful. Um, just so you can do this right through the planning console. It's not, it's not more complicated to go and edit these. If I want to just kind of click on one to get more information on this specific project task, that's literally all I have to do is click on it and see the details, the activity, um, the attachment, and I can edit these if I wanted to. So the state on this is actually a, a work in progress. Uh, I can update it. Now, keep in mind, this is a dev instance, so it is a little bit slower, but that one actually went by pretty fast. Um, so uh, we also have some uh, pretty cool icons up here, uh, like the critical path. Uh, we also have just a general help, which uh, I always find helpful. Uh, just if you haven't worked within this for a while and need to see, the, it's got your legend here as well as some some quick shortcuts. So if you don't, if you're not a project manager that's in here every day working on in the project workspace, this can be super helpful, uh, just in and of itself. Um, you've also got some settings here where you can customize the columns. So you can move your Gantt chart uh, left or right so you can see more of the columns and then go into your settings here and uh, add or remove them. So just quite a few helpful things here uh, just to make kind of the day-to-day the -day of it easier. Now, like I said, if you want to go back to the classic planning, you certainly could. All of the, all the stuff that used to be here is still here. You can still, uh, still click on all of these um, you can see your different tabs up here now i just find i i really like when service now does these changes to workspaces just because i think that they, it makes them more user friendly um, especially if you've never used the old way now there's always going to be people that uh have seen this the old way like it that way and don't need to ch change uh, but the fact of the matter is it, it is changing here uh, so if I go back home, it is going to start me on this My Projects. So if I don't have any projects associated with me, and I currently don't because, like I said, all I've got in the system is demo data, um, but I can also view the all projects. I can also search the projects if I knew what they were called. Uh, you can change your sort and do an actual search on it as well. So quite a few cool things here. Uh, a lot of it was already existing or very closely existed, but I think that this new project workspace really kind of ties it up into just an easier way to function, uh, to look at this project management information on a day-to-day -day basis. And that's all I've got for today. Thank you and have a great day.